All right, folks, Tommy Cowett here on the lawn. Beautiful day in August. Uh, up, unfortunately, we've got some turf issues here. A Bermuda lawn that was under attack. As you can see, it's actually recovering underneath here. Now, you can see there's really the turf itself. The foliage has not been under attack uh, as far as eaten by any insects might lead us to believe we've got a root issue here looking close under a uh, hand lens I did see some spores and Kennedy spores and that led me to believe that this was anthracnose disease of turf and you can see this it doesn't kill the, the root there is a basal anthracnose that will attack the sheath this whole lawn was absolutely gorgeous at one point but it's recovering, as you can see. And uh, the whole lawn was under attack. But it's starting to make a comeback. We did it for fertilizing. We told the uh, homeowner here to raise the mowing height a little bit. But look at these irregular patterns. I mean, they're all very strange. There's nothing... You know, this one's even kind of squared off. Looks like the United States. You know, and just really bizarre shapes you know you see how you've got healthy turf and then the attack took place which took out the foliage it leads me to believe that this is anthracnose and I keyed it out as such by finding some canidia spores I got here too late after the fact did run into some mole crickets today <clears throat> so what I'm going to do right now is see if we can't get some mole crickets to come to the surface. I'm going to pour some soapy water out in this area and just see if I get anything to come to the surface. I'll give it a minute here. You know, it could be something underneath. Mole crickets do enjoy. Uh, root systems and this is a way to flush them and get them to come to the surface I found a mole cricket this morning in a little lawn that had checked <coughs> one spot I'm not seeing anything surface if there was activity under here we would start to see something emerge I didn't think we were going to see that but if you can look close at some of uh, some of this these stolens little black canidia spores and we had certainly had the heat for anthracnose anthracnose this, this type of anthracnose it's attacks the foliage is uh is it's during hot hot weather and we had some 96 109 temps okay so i'm gonna rule out mole crickets attack and stick with my first um diagnosis which was uh anthracnose of bermuda grass way we what we did was we came in and did a fungicide application and I'm sure that took care of it and stopped it. But as you can see, one of the things about anthracnose is it did not kill the uh, roots. And it's making a comeback. So, folks, that's it. That's, uh, that's anthracnose, folks. All right, Tommy signing out. If you need some lawn care, give us a call. Growing Green. Go to our website, growinggreen.com. Or call 336-854-7999. Tommy signing out. Hope you're having a great one.